Rebecca, Genesis, and Benny, and today is National Peace Day! People bring us close to having more peaceful, inclusive societies free from fear and violence. Everyone can help bring more peace to the world. Uh, one person cannot make a difference in the world, but together we can all make a change to God's world. Is it just me, or is there a lot of new teachers this year? A bunch, like six or seven. Uh -huh. Uh, let's go meet our new ELA and literature middle school teacher, Miss Edmonds. Hey, so you're Miss Edmonds, the new middle school teacher. Yes, I am. Would you mind participating in the news crew? Absolutely. All right. We'll answer. We'll ask you a few questions. All right. If you had three wishes, like any three wishes, what would they be? Uh, go back to Italy, visit Spain, and visit Ireland. Nice. A lot of places you like to go. Mm -hmm. All right. Would you mind? today playing Two Truths and a Lie. Absolutely. Alright, what are your two truths and one lie? So, I taught piano for 16 years. I love country music and I attended the University of Georgia. Lies, actually, I taught piano for 16 years. I only taught piano for six years. Really? I did not know that. Is it just me or is the volleyball singing going really well? It is. Our last game is on Monday. Let's go, see, let's go check in with Coach Little to see what's happening. Hey, Coach Little here, and I'm with some of the volleyball girls, and we are here to show you how to do the proper overhand serve. Serve it up, Rebecca! Serve it up! Serve it up! Woo! It has been 10 years, but we have beat ACAD! I don't think I'm very confident about receiving communion. Yeah, me either. Let's go see how to do it from Good Night, Bad Night. Today we are going to learn how to properly receive communion. Before you receive communion, you will be in line, ushered up, uh, before you get to Father or the Eucharistic Minister. You need to bow. If you are receiving on the tongue, you will kneel at the kneeler. And please make sure you put your tongue out far enough so that you can receive Jesus safely. Um, it's okay to stick out your tongue at Father. That's what he'll tell you the only time. Um, nice and long. And if you are receiving in the hand, please make sure that your hand placement is correct. One hand under the other. The hand that you use a pencil with should be underneath. If you're receiving in the hand, you will take Jesus. You will receive right in front of Father or the Eucharistic minister. Do not step aside. That's new. So receive right there and step to then step to the side. Don't forget to say amen after Father or the minister says the body of Christ. Now we're going to show you the right and wrong ways to receive communion. Normally we would be using unconsecrated hosts to practice, but we couldn't find those for filming today. So we will be using, um, these are not consecrated hosts that we are using. So. Remember, if you are not Catholic or you are not receiving communion that day, to cross your arms over your chest and receive a blessing instead. Receive Jesus in your heart. Receive Jesus in your heart. Thanks for watching! SAS signing out!
<laughs> Why are you looking at me? Hi, so you're Miss Evans. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright. Well, Do you mind playing two truths in a lie with us? Absolutely. Alright. Oh, God. When am I supposed to say after that?